We all know that MS Dhoni is one of the greatest players of all times. However, his skills, mindset, ability to stay calm and focused makes him stand out between all the legendary players. In this video, we have compiled 10 amazing skills of MS Dhoni. So sit back and enjoy the whole video. Number 10, amazing presence of mind. In a match between India and Australia, when Dhoni got out, he made sure that Manish Pandey has crossed him so that new batsman does not have to face the next ball. Well bowled by Mitch Marsh, good catch by David Warner. Look at the excitement there. What about that for captaincy, the presence of mind. Get past me, get yourself on strike. Oh, I'm amazing captaincy in thinking of that. Dhoni goes for 34. Dhoni fooled Mitchell Marsh by acting as if the ball is not thrown on his side. And Mitchell Marsh found himself and in shot. But why in the world did he not die? Well, the credit for that must go to the cunning MS Dhoni. Look at the replay again, this time in slow-mo. As Marsh runs back to complete the second run, Dhoni acts as if the ball is not coming to him. Marsh is technically not running to the danger end. Since Dhoni gives nothing away, he possibly presumes that the ball has gone to the other end. And then suddenly, wham! Before Marsh could realize what was happening, off came the base. Number 9. DRS Reviews When it comes to taking DRS and challenging the umpire's decision, Dhoni has the best record. He has hardly wasted any reviews. Rarely a piece for something that's not up and straight away sees nothing from the umpire that says, let's go upstairs. Maybe my missing Dhoni thinks he's still the captain. Number 8, an ultimate finisher. MS Dhoni has a fantastic match finishing record. This clip is from 2013 Selcon Cup match between India and Sri Lanka. More often at the death, you see batsmen sitting deep so that they can get underneath the Yorker, but Dhoni is not doing that. India needed 5 of 3 balls, but only 1 wicket was left. Magnificent! Magnificent Mahindra! He is unbelievable in so many ways. He has taken India to victory by just one wicket. This clip is from 2016's Rising Pune Super Giants vs Kings 11 Punjab. Pune needed 6 of 1 ball and Dhoni did that easily. Number 7, Calm Sledging Replies. It's in the air and quickly into the advertising hoardings. When Dhoni hit Akriti for a beautiful inside-out shot, Akriti started abusing him. However, in return, Dhoni just smiled and in the very next ball, again hits Akriti for a 6. Okay. It was slow in the air and picked up the, the line very early and Shahid Afridi is not ha happy. Once again in the air. And it's got the distance as well. So Dhoni joining Sehwag in the party. And the 50 runs partnership comes up of just 34 balls. Well, the heat is on. Well, these two, they are turning it on for India and also for the spectators here. Number 6, Blind Runouts. Dhoni is the best when it comes to blind runouts. Have a look how quickly he gets back to his feet. It's flat on the bounce and Dhoni. Glove off. No, glove on. Bang. Brilliant. Number 5, Fooling Opposition Like a Boss Want the run, they get it quite easily in the end. In fact, they're looking for two. It's 
knocked off the stones on the ground. This is being referred. This is sloppy work from England. Rubbing salt into the wound, I think it's called. Very, very good cricket. This time he's gone. Sachin Tendulkar has prevailed. That is intelligent stuff. Afridi got his bat down on time the previous occasion, but not this one. He's got to go, and that's a big one for India. Well, the game of cricket is a game of angles, and Sachin Tendulkar has been around long enough now to play the angles game, came around the wicket, firing the ball across with the angle, spinning it further, and he tested Afridi's patience. Number four, the helicopter shot. Dhoni, Dhoni is the call. He's hit it in the air. Peter trying to get underneath it. And he has gone all the way. Now, just watch this back, back lift and watch the follow through at the moment of impact. Uh, just yeah. there you go that'll do I'm not quite sure what he did there but it's very very effective straight down the ground never seen a shot like that before that's real whippage Typical Dhoni shot. Look at the bottom hand. And look at how he finishes. And it's gone the distance. It's a big round here at the IPCL. Number three, lightning pass dumping. Oh, it's easy. Go back. It's right on the money that did the foot come out. I think it probably came out at some stage. But when the bales came off, where was it? Did he get to he's out there for whoa, sure? Whoa, 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 whoa. It's all an anti-climax because of Donny's way of doing it out. He got him easy. Got him easy. Smart work from the Indian captain. Lightning. He took that ball on the go. Brilliant. When it comes to stumping, there is no wicket keeper even close to Dhoni. He holds the record for most stumping in ODI and T20 cricket. Number two always sacrificed himself for the team. Despite of his back injury, Dhoni came back to save the match. But unfortunately, he didn't succeed. And uh, cheap wickets again. So he will be in 44 degrees centigrade probably till around uh, 3.34 in the afternoon. In the air and gone. Wow. Can you believe it? Drinks have just been taken. A bit of bounce there. And well done to Shajid Mahmood. He gets another wicket, but what a knock. What a knock it's been for the local hero, Dhoni. And the local lad this time chipped it right into the hands of uh, the mid wicket fielder. Solanki came running in, gleefully accepted it. And that's the end of Dhoni. What a magnificent knock that was from uh, Dhoni. He is disappointed, no doubt about it. And Dhoni's gone for 96, India 186 for 6. Another incident when he injured his eyes in the first inning but still came back on to do the wicket keeping in the second inning. Number 1, humble gestures and true sportsmanship. 2 for the third wicket. Then in the final ball of the session, incredible controversy. Owen Morgan thought he'd scored 4 here after some clumsy fielding by Pravan Kumar. 
batsmen began walking off the tee. Replay showed though the ball never actually touched the rope. So when the bales came off with Morgan and Bell on their way back to the pavilion, India appealed, perhaps unsportingly, for the unlikeliest run out you will ever see. And the letter of the law said Bell had to go. Ian Bell was given run out in the most bizarre circumstances. And savory end it seemed to a brilliant innings of 137. And England... But the Indian captain withdrawn his appeal and showed the world that playing the game in the right spirit was more important to him than winning. Tony had sportingly withdrawn their successful appeal over Bell's controversial run out. Dhoni won ICC Spirit of Cricket Award for this gesture. Also, like this video and share it with your friends.